Three teenagers who walked away from a fiery crash in Palm Harbor could face felony murder charges in the deaths of the three others who were killed. That's because deputies say both cars involved in the crash were stolen. And under Florida law, murder charges can be filed if someone dies while a felony is being committed. The six teenagers were no strangers to the law. The sheriff says between them, they had been arrested 126 times and jailed 43 times. He says he believes the system failed them. The juvenile justice system is not working. There's not enough consequence. And when there's not enough consequence, there's no fear of consequence. And Katie, we are also getting a look at some new video of that deadly crash. This clip is from a nearby gas station on Highway 19. Look at the upper right corner. There you go of your screen and you'll see the SUV come in at a high speed and explode into a fireball right there. Deputies say at times they were going over 100 miles per hour. Now, here's another view. Sorry, the screen is out, but I'll describe it for you. It's from a nearby dealership. There you go. You'll see the screen light up in the upper right and the Explorer roll into view and come to a stop. A few seconds after the SUV crashes, you see a patrol car pull up to the scene. And finally, here is a view from that patrol car's dash cam. The deputy runs over to the SUV with a fire extinguisher, and it looks like he gets those flames out. Two teenagers were trapped inside the SUV and died. Two others were thrown out. One of them died. Deputies say the other two teenagers were in a second car that was not involved in this crash but was stolen.